Jonah Peretti's BuzzFeed has been expanding like crazy, hiring writers from all over the place. I spoke to Peretti about his plans for the site. This is Media Beat. Look, things change. Anyone with a camera is so cute. Right now, so we should pay attention to the way we are. We evolve. Jonah, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me. So, uh, BuzzFeed has obviously been in the news recently. You hired Ben Smith as the new editor in chief. Can you talk a little bit about what you're trying to do there? From the start, we were obsessed with social content, the kind of things that people feel like they want to share in their Facebook news feed or post to Twitter. Uh, and what what counts as social content has evolved as social media has grown up. So initially, your Facebook news feed was just news about your friends. Then people started to post things like cute cat pictures or funny humor or jokes or things like that um, because that's inherently social content. You, you, you share an emotion with your friends saying, oh, that's cute, or you laugh with your friends over a, uh, over a joke. And then as social media has grown up, we started to see a story about the Arab Spring or original content or um, pieces that are emotionally resonant like the, that tiger mom story in the Wall Street Journal that was passed around where it's a piece that everyone who has an ethnic mom can relate to, but it's also a, a long form original piece of content and so we saw this shift happening where instead of just getting personal news from social media people started to get all their news and all their content um, from social media and so we have evolved with um, that that trend and we hired Ben Smith to lead as editor-in-chief he's brought in an amazing talented group of web native savvy journalists and reporters and, and content uh, um, creators of various ki of kinds and really we are building a social publishing site that, has, that runs the whole gamut of the kind of, of content that people, people love to, to share. So obviously there's been kind of a focus on politics with Ben Smith, but you've also poached a, a tech writer from Gizmodo, you, you poached a you know, well-known culture writer, you're, you're expanding to these other verticals too. Yeah, Ben is not, we didn't hire Ben to run the politics vertical, we hired him as editor-in-chief to, to define um, lots of new areas where we have reporters who have beats and sources and can do original work. The kind of work that, that reporters love to do, where they dig in on a story, they're not aggregating, they're not just summarizing what's happening elsewhere, they're, they're creating something new and, and original. BuzzFeed initially had no verticals and was organized by human emotion, which I think worked for very well for this, the world of the social web, where content was less about what it was the topic was about and more about how people reacted to it and what, how it made people feel. Um, and I think that what we're seeing is that, is that as we add verticals, um, those two worlds will intersect and both will be important. And we can have verticals that are pretty broad, but in order to have a reporter who has sources, we need them to be a specialist to some extent. And so that's really why we, we are launching sure. verticals. But the memes aren't going away. Oh yeah, we're not, we're not backing away or changing what we, what we uh, have done. Um, historically, we're mixing them together to make the, the definitive social publishing site. I mean, I, I sort of think about if you were reading some cyberpunk novel about, about um, you know, that takes place in some future uh, world, the place where you get all your news would also have cute kittens and web culture and memes all mixed together. And, but that would also be the place you go to get the real news about what's happening in the world. Um, and so I think um, it's become natural for people to see all these things mixed together. They're mixed together in your Twitter feed, your Facebook feed. So why not make a publishing site where all these things are mixed together as well? So you've been hiring uh, a number of staffers. What are, you, what are you looking for when you're looking for new journalists or other staffers to join BuzzFeed? So um, Ben has been leading the hiring. And you know, he has the freedom to hire the kind of people he wants to hire. Um, and he has been very focused on finding people who are at home in the social web. And so someone who, can, can, who is good at tenacity, has a tenacity and can get information that nobody else knows and can tell our audience something they didn't know yet, um, I think that is a, is a key in, uh, on the social web. It's not about aggregating what people already know into a nice package. It's about finding things people didn't know yet and, and getting a, a real scoop and telling people something new.